Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 2. It is time for us to head out of this small tavern and head Very off well. to do Yoshimo's quest. Now, what is Yoshimo's quest? Well, I'm going to pause actually while I do it because I accidentally walked outside. I forgot that walking outside is very dangerous at night. So Yoshimo's quest is this one. Find proof of Mavar's treachery. Renal Bloodscalp, leader of the Shadow Thieves, has hired me to infiltrate the guild house of one of his underlings, a man by the name of Mavar. I am to find the proof of Mavar's treachery while I work under him. Renal has given me papers that will allow me to pass as a member of the Shadow Thieves. I am to report to Gorch in Mavar's storefront. Once I have the proof, I am to return to Renal. So, our goal, just to recap, find proof of Mavar's treachery. That's it. That's our entire goal. So, let's go and do that. I look forward to right, it. ignore the harlot. And I believe it's this one right here. Oh, actually, before we do that, the Minotaur building. I was told there's a second floor that I missed. I will enjoy this. Yes, there is. These are stairs. Okay. Okay, I definitely missed I this, will huh? Take care of this. <laughs> this this seems um this seems good and important. Uh, happy I came back in here. What is this? No, no. Everybody up here. Make sure we have both of the melee people up here. Well, both our frontline melee people. Quick save. Click on it. When you touch the skull, its eyes blaze with an eerie light and it begins to speak. Can we go for the first part? The lid of the sarcophagus moves easily aside despite the dire warnings and guardian runes written on the side. Inside rests a golden skull. As you reach for it, it seems to move. At last, I return to awareness. Who is it that has awakened me? I'm Felix, an adventurer. Then you have found your fortune at last, Felix. I am in need of your assistance. Serve me well and you will be rewarded beyond your wildest imaginings. What are you? What has happened to you? I am Kangax. Wait a second. I know that name. I think. I don't know why I know that, but I definitely know that name. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Wait a second. It's coming back to me. Could this be related to the character in... There's like a secret boss in Dragon Age Origins. Which I believe was made, was based off of a boss in Baldur's Gate 2. Which was known to be very difficult. I'm wondering whether these are... This is the person... I'm not entirely sure of the name. It's been a while since I last played um, Dragon Age Origins. And it's also not quite the same name. But it just rung something in the back of my head. I was like, wait a second. I know this. Anyway. And I have been cursed. I am dead yet not dead. Cursed to eternal entrapment in this tomb by cruel enemies. Cursed to a fate worse than death. But the curse can be reversed. With your assistance, I may live again. I have suffered for so long. Will you help me? I'll do what I can to help. The fiends that did this to me keep me from returning by tearing apart my mortal form and keeping the pieces separated. You must find my body that I might take. I might, I might again take mortal form. Okay, where can I find these parts? They are very close. I have no doubt that they lie within the city, in tombs such as this. My enemies are predictable, if nothing else. Seek my arms, legs, and torso. You will be reward well rewarded for your efforts, Felix. Hurry, find the pieces and return. Okay. It will be done. Interesting. Interesting. He didn't prom promise me wealth and power. That is not a top. Th 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 that is an incorrect journal. That is not what he offered me. The journal right here. Where are we uh, for this quest? Restore uh, Kangax's body. Quite clearly, it didn't. He did not offer me wealth and power. What he said is I would be well rewarded. Now you know, usually you could assume wealth and power, but it's not technically you what he said. He said well forth. rewarded, and that's the kind of thing where there's a lot of like room wiggle room. Easily, like he could say. Um, 
you'll be well rewarded by serving me uh, after I kill you and resurrect you as a skeleton, right? Um, that would be reasonable for an evil person to say. But, who knows? Anyway, it's going to turn out I have the wrong person. I'm paranoid about nothing, and actually this guy's just like some skull, but whatever. Hello, Very Gorks. Well. Or Gorch. Welcome to my humble establishment. Ah, do come in. Uh, come in. Take a look around if you wish. I'm Gorch, the humble proprietor of this modest establishment. What is it that you sell? I sell many things. Things sold to me by those in need. Trinkets to heirlooms. Gorch has everything of taste and necessity that you may desire. Um, okay, let's see what you have. Naturally, Gorch is here to please. Might be interested in this elegant hat. Quite the fashion in Waterdeep, no? Well, by all means, look about. Okay, so you can buy drink here. You can also buy a collection of garbage weaponry. Okay, okay. Studded leather armor plus one. Ring of Princes is probably good. Now that's an armor class up. Nymph cloak. Two extra charisma. Charm creature once per day. Okay. That's reasonable. Bracers to the death. We already have one of them. Raise dead. Let me just buy that while we're here. A gem bag? What's a rogue stone? Just a shiny stone? Okay. Um, yeah, we'll buy the gem bag to see if we have anything else in here we need. Might buy the nymph cloak and the ring of princess. Let's go crazy. I'm not even going to check if I need it. I'm just going to buy them. Right. Gem bag. Actually, you know what? Gem bag can sit on Dorne. That gives us a gem bag on the main looter. That's actually kind of good. Uh, you know what? Why don't you keep this scroll? Just in case. Um, just in case Jahira dies, that actually gives us a way to res. You can use the minus one, and then charisma. It matters who's talking, but I think it also matters who the main character is occasionally. Like, I believe it's whoever talks to the enemy, or whoever talks... Why, why am I calling every person you talk to an enemy? That's a bad mindset. Um, whenever you talk to somebody in the game, um, it's the charisma of the person talking to them that matters. So if your main character had no charisma, then it would all it, then you know you would want someone else to talk all the time. But there are some conversations where your main character's charisma does matter, like the one that we had with Dorn um, previously. Anyway, hopefully that all makes sense. Um, so yeah, that's why we're gonna do that. Also, Charm Creature is not terrible, I guess. It's kind of like, eh, whatever. But, it's okay. It might be okay. Wait, does that have something else on it? I just noticed, it, does it actually have lore? Um, it's renowned for its ability to increase the charisma of even the most surly dwarf. A Cormorian noble, hoping to make her politically convenient uh, marriage more palatable, apparently went to great expense to obtain one for herself. And another for her husband. Oh, well that's kind of sensible actually. Yeah, in a world where stats exist, just make yourself better I at talking. Look forward to it. Okay. I'm just like looting as a normal person would loot. You know, when you go into a shop, you go and loot it. Just as a normal person would. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. Right. Kill this. them all and have done with that's it. That's fine. Uh, what's this one? That is a strength one. Okay. Well, you might as well have it. What's this do? Oil of speed. Okay. Uh, increases your movement speed. I guess take it for just now. You. Uh, I need you to... Eat a foot and all that. Take 190 gold from him. I mean, he's in charge of a shop run by thieves. He can't be mad if we steal things. Um, I'm not here to buy anything. I'm here to see Mavar. Ah, why did you not simply say so earlier? You have something written for me, yes? Hmm? Um, um, yes. Everything appears to be in order. You can see Mavar through the door in the back. Uh, so nice to meet you, my good friend. Is it this door? Yes, I think it's that door, which means I want to go through the other door so that I can see what he's got hiding back here. Or maybe they both link into the same room. Zintris, who are you? Oh, you don't have a red head. You just have a red 
cloak. Okay. Hello. Explain your intent and make it good. I don't recognize you. What do you want? I'm looking for Mavar, actually. He's downstairs doing what he loves best, of course. Yeah. It's what he always does to unnerve newcomers. You'll be expected to go down there and speak with him while he does it, naturally. I see, and who are you? I'm Zinthris. Let's just get this straight now, so there's no mistaking it later, alright? I'm the senior cut purse. Me. Not nobody else. Try to slide in on me and I'll stick you, got it? Fine, fine, I'll leave you alone. Run down the road on fire for all I care. Wow, so rude. Okay. Do you not know you're speaking to Dorn? Dorn's just waiting for an excuse. With everybody, apart from us. I will take we become Dorn's one friend who will never betray. And honestly, I'm not sure that's a good thing. Um, but you know, whatever. Uh, so what that's upstairs. I can do it upstairs. So that must be the downstairs route. Okay. Let's speak to Gorvin. Explain your intent and make it. Ah, what is this about? Is there a fire? What's the trouble? I'm looking for Mavar. Well, he's gone down to the cellar. He has working on poor old Lin. He is mighty shame that. Hmm. Got to be a bottle around here somewheres. May I ask who you are? Me hey, name's Gorvin. Don't suppose you have a bottle of rot got uh, of rot got stored away in there somewhere, do you? I uh, suppose not. Who are you anyway? I'm Felix. I was pro transferred here. Transferred, eh? Well, that was bloody quick. Lin not even being cold or nothing. Oh well, good to meet you, Felix. Well, I'll be on my way. Well, I didn't miss you before you talked to me, did I? Or did I? Terrible thing losing your memory. My medicine's gotta be here. I just had it, I'm sure. Swing harder, swing harder, swing That's harder! Uh, I keep forgetting that the sword talks. Honestly, it's a little disconcerting. I will but easily. That's okay. Let's head up the stairs. There we go. Um, a waste I'm just of my going to talents. continue looting. I Watch hope you're okay with that. Don't like the way you crouched after I looted. That's fine. That character is too far away, really. <sighs> it shall be. There we go. Right, Dorn. Chuck the book over. Chuck the book into the bookcase. Um, let's do this. Yoshimo is willing. Right. And uh, that can go to you. That can go in your gem bag. Nice. This one. Very well. Ooh, money. Nice. Open. Go. This is fine. All right. This. Locked. Book. More histories of something. That's okay. Uh, Yoshimo. I'm ready. I think you're right Open behind me, right? Oh wait, does not have a conventional lock and is warded against simple spells. Okay, so there's some mechanism stopping that. That's weird. Alright, let's continue exploring. Can we loot <sighs> all of these? What is going on here? They're all locked? Wait, are these all lock picking I tests? Enjoy this. Oh, that's really funny. I, I like that. Well, very well. Get to work. Hiya. Then they're locked, so you can do this and get even more experience off of each of them. That's fine. You know what? We'll loot them in a second. I just need you to unlock them all. There we go. This is fine. Yeah. Okay. You really need to clean me. I Just like gaining to a shine. ton of experience <laughs> here. Oh, and these aren't real. These doors are obviously meant to test a thieves' lock picking ability. Okay. Well, we've succeeded. I will take care. Okay. Of this. Grab. Grab. It's just like I thought it Ooh, love Helping all that. Others and doing good and then this. Doing good, she says, after we just murdered someone with her in the party and then proceeded to join a, th a thieves guild and started looting it. Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay, grab that. Grab that. And grab that. 
Okay. Well, that's a lot of loot. Ooh, I some more I missed over Khan. here. I do as I what about will. this? You do not what about give these? Me orders. These are probably locked, huh? Never mind. Please unlock it. There we go. Ooh, hoo hoo! It will be done. I bet that these are like linked to your skills, if that makes sense. So you get better loot if you're um, doing a more difficult lock, and uh, there's probably an order as you move around the room. I think that's how it's meant to be. I don't know if you're meant to be able to unlock them all the first time you're here, but, you know, we did. Uh, let's have a look. Your lore is 42, your lore is 33. Okay, so I need to reduce some of the strain on your uh, system here, in terms of what you're holding. Let's give some of this to Corgan just to clear out some space. There we go. Right, that seems fine. So now we can chuck all of these over and we can start identifying what we've actually got here. So studded leather. Uh, not going to be good for you. You've got orc leather. You've got studded leather. Oh, perfect. Well, that's 100% that's good for you then. That's just a straight... Well, that should be a straight upgrade. It's not because we have the ring on. There we go. Wait, why is that not a straight upgrade? So that's armor class 6 versus armor class 7. Yeah. You know why it's not a straight upgrade? It's because we have the bracers to the death on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that, that's why it's not a straight upgrade. Because it, it doesn't upgrade what we're wearing. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I mean, just stick it there to sell. Um, this doesn't actually increase our armor class to wear it. So why don't I give this to you? That will increase your armor class. Okay. Wait, if I take these off... Yeah, okay, so th that is putting our ar that is actually moving our armor class. Actually, putting them on doesn't, but, you know, it would had, was our armor class above zero. Okay, um, in which case, these are spare. There we go, just move those out of the way. Cool, uh, what else have we got here? Short sword, I can't identify, and a buckler plus one. Buckler is going to be sold, short sword is... Short sword plus two... That's not bad. I mean, it's not amazing, but you know. Uh, we're missing our other weapon. Oh, we're missing our other weapon because it's on Corgan. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Mind your tone. That's fine. Let's do a quick save. Easily. Uh, we've already looted that one. Let's have a chat to Anishi. Yes. I need to find Mavar. Where is he? Well, just go down those stairs over there and you'll find Mavar engaged in the business of information extraction. Forcible extraction, that is. Who are you again? Well, the real question is, what is your name, darling? I could tell you that my name is Anishé, but that would prevent me from hearing the delectable tones of your name first. My name is Felix. Pleased to meet you. Felix, how utterly delicious. I shall recite it over and over to myself in between each of our meetings, which I do hope will not be too far between. Mm. All right, I must be going now. Already, how sad. Okay. A waste of my talents, loot. but so be it. What's well, a waste of your talents to loot? I do think you've got your priorities wrong there. It's a privilege to be allowed to be the one who loots. Right. Um, let's try this place. It probably takes us outside, right? Yeah, okay. Very well. And then, I'm um, actually, I'm assuming the other one I takes us out to the other exit. <laughs> Which is very weird. No, so that'll take us outside. Okay. I will enjoy we can this. still loot this place, though. It would be funny if we solve the thing before we actually speak to Mavar. Like we find some book that actually solves uh, I will take care of this. The, the the quest we're on. Right, uh, like I'm just gonna Nothing assume. dangerous, I would hope. There we go, and this one as well. Nice. It will be done. Get to looting. And get to looting. There we go. Easily. And loot this one. Yep. And this one. Almost want to give him our book um, scroll case, but like I, I couldn't risk it. You know, what if it fell into the wrong hands? 
we would never be able to read all those books. Bastard Sword plus one. It's gonna go there. We'll give it to him temporarily just to stick these books in. Okay. Right. Quick save. I am John Il Khan. I do That's as locked. I will. Huh? You okay. do not give me Unlock I it. can dance on the head of a pin as well. Okay, you, you find this not a door at all, but a clever painting and molding on the wall. A waste of my talent. Okay. But so be it. Okay. Nothing in here. This one? Oh, a table. I like tables. They got loot on them. It's fine, down here. We have this one. With a cabinet in the back. Doran will loot it. Two health potions. Nice. You are and then this very one. Well. Oh, which leads to some stairs down. Oh, okay. Kind of a loop. What we've done here. I don't know where these actually lead, though. It's the only bit I'm missing. So I don't remember there being stairs up from down there. Right, Yoshimo. Fleet of foot and all that. Grab that, and then we will also send you over this one. Spear plus one. Okay. I look forward to it. Oh, that I sends us here. This. That's where actually stairs up. Never mind. All right, and then that just. All right, now I know where that sends you. Okay. So it's just so you can access this place from multiple angles, I guess? I mean, it's kind of neat. It could I just be a, like a thematic thing, like you can access it from multiple angles because it's like a thieves guild house and it makes sense that you could access it from all these different places because you don't want everyone coming in the front door. Or it could be gameplay wise, uh, you're going to be coming back here a lot so let's make it easy for you to travel it will here. Be done. Which is definitely a possibility, you know? Um, right. In there. Easily. All the way along, and then we'll go see the person being tortured. At least that's what I'm assuming is happening downstairs. You ready? There we go. Go. A waste There's of more my loot. Talents. Well, but don't so mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Keep looting. I like that it's hidden behind an illusory wall. That means you have to actually um, have illusion high enough to even get to this quest. That's kind of a neat little um, like roadblock. There we go. Um, oh, you can hold on to that for just now. Right, quick save. Very oh. well. Kamuzu. Can I just walk in here? Yeah, okay. I'm assuming these aren't prisons then. Alright, hey Mavar. No cutscene conversation. Well, let's head in here and speak to Kamuzu then. I'm nothing of value. Please let me be. Mercy, sir. Mercy, if you please. Quiet, you. Felix, leave my prisoner alone. It is not your affair. Uh, Master Mavar, it has been a decade. Silence, Kamuzu. Do you wish to visit the table again? No, I shall remain quiet, master. Okay, is his prisoner. Now. Okay. Please come on. Let's Pretty go. please. Hello then. I certainly hope you've got a reason to be bothering me because I'm quite busy as you can see. Ah, poor Lin passed out. I have a few minutes to spare then. Who are you and why shouldn't I kill you? Hmm. Um. Let's see what we're gonna say here. I think number three. I'm with the Shadow Thieves. You wouldn't harm your own kin, would you? Ask my cousin here. He relied on sentiment, thought it would get him out of stealing from guild coffers. Oh no, we've stolen everything in this guild. Perhaps, but he's. But not before he's learned about crossing his betters. Perhaps you'd suggest a kinder, gentler punishment for my kin. Or perhaps I should introduce you to the rack instead, so you might determine your true kinship. Or perhaps not. Scared you, did I? Fear will keep you honest. You don't want to end up like Lin here, with me having to test your honesty. Difficult to do with certainty. Hmm. Better to die an honest man than live as a liar and endanger us all. 
Such thoughts are akin to mine. But I will hold you no closer knowing that you are as cold as I. Instead, a simple quest to test your worth and pad our coffers. I suppose I should make the task something you wouldn't balk at completely. How about a little petty larceny amidst the stuffed robes over at the Temple of Talos? I require... The amulet worn by the weather mistress. Yes, it looked lovely on her, and I have a beautiful... Shelty spaniel cross that it will adorn just as well. You need not kill her to get it. She likely removes it in the night. As pleasing as it is, even, it would leave a welt the size of a melon if slept upon. Now, get moving. I've told you the mark, and you do the rest. Pick it from her in her sleep if you must, but do not bother me again without the goods. Stealing uh, into the temple of the storm god is unlikely to earn you the gratitude of Talassian priesthood, Felix. Best we proceed carefully with this endeavor. Okay. Well, I mean, that doesn't sound too difficult. We just walk in there, say I want your amulet, and then we take it. It's easy. Thorin would be like, kill him. I also get the feeling that we're going to be told off if we kill them, because that's mm. not the yes, point of being a thief. kill them all and have done with it. Right? At least as far as I'm aware. Is to thieve. The man has been tortured severely and is presently unconscious. Was I not clear? Don't come back until you've got the amulet from Weather Mistress at the Temple of Talos. It's simple larceny. If you can't do it, I have no use for you. Some of my finest work. Hello, priest. We head back here. It looks like we can. Bow down before the gods and move beg along. For mercy. Will you? Okay, so not a priest we can speak to. I look forward. All right, I'm just gonna walk into the back. Where does this go? Oh, I will enjoy this. well, that's a good thing to know about. That's a little shortcut. Okay. Uh, well, I wish to leave, so let's go this way. I mean, it's not quite as good as them just putting like an exit to the main map on here, but you know, it's pretty good. I am kind of assuming the priest of Talos is going to be at the temple district. It's a lost child, huh? Well, huh? It sounds like a problem for someone else to deal with. Oh, also want to just check her XP. Yeah, okay, so we're about 10,000 XP uh, closer after all of that um, lock picking. Okay, fair enough. We're getting there. This is usually where someone might attack you, but I think we'll be fine. Who is Althea? I will take care of this. Wait, no, what no, no. Who is this person? You, you sound like you've got a name. Pleasure to meet you. Hello there, good gentleman. My name is Althea. Are you looking for bits of company, perhaps? A question or two, if I could? Was well, that all you want, my lord? I have no objections. You seem to be a woman of class. How is it you came to this life upon the streets? Is it that obvious? I have never done this before. I'm so ashamed, but father is dead and mother cannot feed us. I have to do something. Hmm. Um... Well, here, have 50 gold pieces. I can afford it, and I trust it will tide you over a short while. What? Oh, but you are so too kind, sir. Lathander's blessing upon you. Mother shall be ever so happy. Oh, thank you, thank you. Wait, did she not just say her mother was dead? Or is it just her father who's dead? Um. Uh, oh, mother cannot feed us. Okay, well, that's fine. Done. Well, he's got your nose. I think there's a chance that we have just given somebody money for nothing and we got, you know, scammed, but whatever. We're about to do some very evil things, so I feel like we need to improve our uh, <laughs> standing somewhat. Uh, Temple of Talos. There we go. We have to steal a talisman from it. Ba -doom -doom okay, well, you know, it wasn't that funny. But, you know, it's something to do while we walk. Gotta keep myself amused. Gonna ignore all these people called Talon whatevers. They're probably like, you know, people who work for Talos. I guess if they're called Talons. Very well. It's very loud in here. Uh, whose thing do we need to steal? Uh, not this one. This one. Um, the Weather Mistress's amulet. It is night, right? Yeah. Okay. I look forward to First step, find the weather mistress. Second step, find the I amulet. 
Well, there's Mistress. Do you think it's Mistress Adder? No, because they would say, well for they would us, say yes? Mistress, not it's Weather a dangerous Mistress. Path, but we manage well for ourselves. Okay, this way. This is fine. Weather Mistress. No Weather Mistress here. This side. It might be Mistress Adder. It could definitely be that. That door looks like it's been broken open as well. So there's a thought. It's weird. Doors generally don't look like they've been broken open. Okay. Let's go and speak with her a second and see what she has to say about this. Because she's definitely not asleep and there is a guard right next to her. Hello. You have my greetings, Faithful. I do not. Okay. Um, hmm. Interesting. I am drawn Where do we calm. reckon it's going to be? I do, as I will. Uh, do, do we have any skill in orders. pickpocketing? <laughs> That's probably useful to know, right? So be you. Pickpockets is 25. Uh, we only have moved silently. You can't pickpockets. You have pickpockets of 35. Okay. I will do All right. Can. Quick save. Just have a quick look here. It's gonna move a little bit. You know what? Let's head outside. Let's head out this way and then just go stealth. Failed. Okay. Quick save. Steal. 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 Okay, reload. <laughs> That was not the correct move. And steal. I will do what I can. Okay, and reload. Come on, and now. steal. I no. Come on, come on, I'm getting itchy. Let's go. And steal. Okay, never mind. Right. Are we gonna kill something what would now? You have me it's come probably on, not well. that person. Anything. I reckon. Is there anywhere else we can leave here? No. We might as well just loot this place and then maybe we just find the amulet. I guess that's our other option is we just loot it. Uh, and then see what we get. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. Okay. Maybe this doesn't count as um Yeah, this might also might not count as the right time of day. Uh because this might be like early morning. Wait, that's not even locked. I look forward. Okay. These actually do stack on you, apart from that, which is gonna stack on you. I would I will enjoy. Nice. This. Quick save. Hmm. It's just the term weather mistress, right? That's all that's all that gets me. I'm like. Could that be the weather mistress? She is called mistress, but is she the weather mistress? Do we have a second name for this mistress? As in not as ever with weather mistress. Mm. Okay. No. What about, what about just looting here then? Fleet of foot and all that. Okay, that can be identified. Chuck to you, one of your scrolls. Um that's I guess that was the wrong thing. I don't even know what I gave you. Storm giant strength. That seems unnecessary. Um, right. That's fine. Cool. Um, this one. It is locked. Well. That's fine. This can go to you. You can stick it in the jam bag. And then here. Actually, get out of the way. You loot. I will take care of this. A bispy pig yeah, will for this. Okay, so that is going to go to the gem bag. These are going to go to you. Wonderful. So, how am I going to steal this? <laughs> She's the only person with any kind of mistress title here. This is another entrance to the Temple of Talos. She has to be the person that's talking about it, right? What about in here? Can I loot it? Maybe I can just loot this? 
A waste of my talents. Oh, um, but so be it. Back in. Very well. I look forward to it. It's I am Zornil Khan. Yoshimo is willing. As I will. You do not give me orders. They don't seem to be mad that I just did that. That's okay. Let's, let's just say we need her services. Um, what can we buy from you? A destroyer of the hills, cleric staff, plus three. Yeah, it's very good. We already have a plus three staff though, so. Yeah, and some raised deads, which are okay, but I don't think we need them. Uh, yeah, why don't you identify this for me? Wand of the heavens. Causes a pillar of flame to shoot, so it gives us flame strike. I will take care of this. Okay. Do we need to be stealthing to get a good pickpocket? Like, again, I don't really know how to pickpocket. Uh, I assume you need a good level in the stat, but, like, I don't have a good level in the stat, so let's figure this out. Hidden shadows failed. Can you, like, thieve? No. All the world is Hey, hidden shadows succeeded. I am ready. You're right behind there we are. me, right? You are stealthy. Quick save. Steal. Okay, that seemed to have no difference on whether you actually steal or not. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. Okay, you know what we should do? Now? What would you please, have to do? New, new plan, new plan. Pretty, please. We're gonna check if she's the right person. And then we're gonna try all of this. Uh, everybody? I will listen Attack. For now. Is that what we're after? Let's see if that advances our quest. This wasn't too difficult. Is that the thing I need for my quest? Necklace of Talos? Uh, let's see here. Uh, amulet at night. It's not an amulet though, is it? That's not an amulet. It's a necklace. Now what's the difference? Well, that's a, that's, you know, semantics question. But I don't think now, she's the right now. person. Come on, kill something Very now! Well. Yeah! I'm a little confused. There are stairs up here. Seeing like if there are stairs or somewhere else we can go. Uh, no. Unless that is the amulet. I don't know. I would assume that if it says amulet, it would be an amulet. You know what I'm saying? That is the Temple of Talos, to be fair, not the Church of Talos. Is the Church of Talos a different place to the Temple of Talos? Alright, alright. I Just because I'm very confused about the instructions, I, I will look up the quest. Just to see what the next step is. Like, am, if, am I in the right place or am I in the wrong place? So let's have a look at it. So this is proof of Mavar's treachery. Treachery. Mavar treachery. Find proof of Mavar's treachery. Right, so. Blah de blah de blah. Down the stairs, southeast part of the dock. Blah de blah, blah de blah. Okay, so the thing you're looking for is the. Necklace of Talos. Okay. Well, that's good. We are looking for the Necklace of Talos. Um, during the evening, she should be asleep. Oh, okay. So, we're not, we weren't here in the evening. Okay, so we just need to find a tavern. That, that was our issue. So, it's the right person, wrong time. I suppose it is the middle of the day now, but it wasn't when we arrived, so. By middle of the day, I mean, like, it's 7 o'clock in the morning. But, you know, whatever. We'll leave. Can I just rest here? Yes. Alright. Why am I paying for rooms? I can just rest anywhere. Yeah, okay, I'll just rest here again. I guess maybe you get a buff if you rest at a room. I'm not entirely sure. Right, quick save. Rest. You're awake In the name rest. of the council, I am here to keep order. Find an inn or leave the city. Oh, you're allowed to like rest once and then it's like, nah, 
you know, please, like, actually, this. you know, go find an inn. Okay. Uh, this way? This way? Hmm. Uh, we, we, could we go to this place and rest? You know, we know it's empty. <laughs> it has beds. Just saying. Just saying it's empty. And it has beds. It could be. Wait, this isn't a way to leave? You can't leave out that door? Oh. Well, oh. okay. Because, you know, I'm actually willing to try this. Let's see if we can rest in there. Mainly because it might be useful in the future to be able to move time forward not in an inn. In the same plate, in the same bit. Like, I know in the graveyard district, we could probably do it in the tombs and be fine. I mean, we've already rested in the tombs, so we know it'll be fine. So it'd be useful to have somewhere in each location where we're like, yeah, we could probably rest here. You can probably rest in the guild halls, right? As in uh, the rogue guild hall. Or the thieves guild hall, that's it. Yeah, you could probably rest there. Ah, it's morning night. Okay. Guess he's only around in the morning. That would make sense. Except it's the afternoon. Yes, I, I wish to enter here and then rest. Yes, you can totally just rest in done. this guy's house. Easily. Love it. Love it. Right, let's go. So, we almost had this solved as a quest. We just arrived like at the exact wrong time where it was a crossover between night and day. And it made the quest a little confusing. Now we're arriving at 11 o'clock at night. She should be well asleep. Either that, or we're gonna have some problems. A waste of right. my talents, but so be it. Yeah, steel. Cool. Leave. Oh, and you get like a lot of XP if you do it that way. So that's your punishment for not doing it. Um, the, Very well. Uh, that for not doing it the sneaky ways. You get no. You get like basically no XP. Okay. I understand. Um, I mean, like, the way that we did it the first time, where you just kill her, no XP, so the, the game's just like, you know, you did it wrong. Please reload and try again. Except it doesn't say that. I am at your service. Lady Erlana. Oh, my fair Lady Erlana. Uh, Garrick, isn't it? What can I do for you, Garrick? I, uh, I, uh. I am here to pledge to you the love of a poet and an artist. Take my fragile love, my sweet. Hold it in your hands and as I gaze upon you admiringly. I am here to pledge uh, to you the love of, of a poet and an artist. Take my fragile love, my sweet. Hold it in your hands as I gaze upon you admiringly. Uh, yes, that's right. Oh, I see. Well, thank you, Garrick. Are you serious, Rolana? The man's a fop. Come with me, my lady, and let me... Ow, oh, damn insects. Wait, fool, don't say that. Come with me, my lady, and let me out. Damn insects. No, fool, don't... Ah. Uh, you got a prize here, my lady. So I see. Um, excuse me for a moment. It's just a weird random event, or can we start speaking to these people? It's a good thing for... Sarando, that he has such a way of words. He is a good friend. I'm a pure, pure excuse for a bard. Was Garrick not a companion in the first game? I'm starting I to think that he might have been, and then this is, like, mm, his cameo. Yes! This foolish boy Garrick can barely take instruction. Sometimes I think he barely has a thought in his head. Hello there. Garrick can be an amusing man, but he'll hardly take my heart. For a bard, he seems to have a hesitant and awkward grasp of courtly words. I welcome you with outstretched I am Sir Cantrill, knight of the most uh, noble order of the Radiant Heart. Pleased to make your acquaintance, my lord. Yeah. Uh, please ignore my companion's um, resemblance to the person who caused um, not one of your brothers orders. to be, you know, like, ugh, dead. You know? I will enjoy please this. ignore that. Uh, what's the quickest way in here? The quickest way in is probably through the back one, because then you don't have to travel through the uh, house. Although, there's no loading screen, so through the house isn't that slow. But yeah, this is probably the quickest way in. Just let it kind of move itself along. We could move the you camera know, as well, I could just basically enter an area, take my hands off the uh, 
You click it once, hands off the keyboard, and off it plays itself. But, you know, not quite there. There's a temptation, like, there's our door, just go in. But by going this way, we're, we are going to avoid having to go down the stairs. So it does make sense, but anyway. There's got to be a quicker way here, right? I'm trying to think. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Wait. Oh, it's just Harlot and Sailor. I thought that was uh, the Harlot we gave money to. I will right. take care of this. Turn around here. We'll do a little quick save. And then we'll speak to Mavar. Well, you're back at last. I'll cancel the order to kill you then. You have a few skills we might find useful after all. Now let's have a look at that amulet. It's a mystery how they walk with a dinner plate around their necks. I'll file it with the other garbage sent to Kalasham. They like jewellery big, I hear. Now let's put you to some real work. I haven't the time to piddle around with you, so my right-hand man will keep you busy until you can work for me personally. His name is Edwin. Edwin is the um, companion from Baldur's Gate 1 that we killed. This must be Edwin. Okay. So I knew he was in the game. I just thought he was going to be the person who was wearing red for that other quest. No, he's actually here. Okay, this is a problem. Okay, so what we would need to do is we need to swap out Nalia for Edwin. <laughs> Which means that our party is going to be almost entirely evil. But let's ignore that. Uh... I suppose it's good, I guess. Um, usually, um, right, bloody good spellcaster, but he likes his luxuries. Usually happens to adventurers that hate the road. He's on the third floor above us. Get going. Okay. Um, how do I move everything that she's got to somebody else? Um, okay, let's start by moving these over here. You can keep your arrows. Just make sure that these all go here. That's fine. So we're stacked up to the max. Uh, those can stack a little bit. Okay. Wands and stuff. These can go to Jahira temporarily. Although she can actually use some of them. That's probably useful info for me to have. These can go to Dorne for carrying and selling. I just picked the thing that I gave to Dorne and gave it back to Dorne. This can go to... I to drop to your item on the ground. I can carry no more. You. That's just a plus one bow. It's still pretty good, but it's just a plus one bow. That can go to, to you. I on the ground. I can carry no oh, more. Oh, that's, that's your ring. Okay, and then these can go to you for just now. Although nobody else needs them, so like, why don't you just wear them for just right this second? Oh, wait, no, because Edwin might need... Well, we have a backup if Edwin needs one. That's fine. It will be done. Right. Head upstairs. Let's see. Uh, if it sounds like he's going to join our party, I guess we... Easily. I don't know, dump the... Well, I guess we could dump the bow before we speak to him. Yeah, let's just dump the bow to you for just now, and we'll give the bow back if what he uh, gives us a task. Of my talents. But so be it. Right. Very Edwin. well. Okay, third floor. Uh, so this is the second floor, so this will be the third floor. Right. Sorry, minor confusion because that's an American versus British I thing. Look forward to it. So in Britain, this would be the fourth floor because the first floor is... Because the floor that you enter into is called the first floor in Britain. But I believe in America, that's the ground floor. And then the first floor would be the floor above that. It's a little bit weird that there's like this just very minor difference. But, you know, slightly I would me enjoy up. this. Hello, Edwin. Now, you see why I think Edwin was the person with the red, um, like that we've got the red cloth from, right? Piece of red cloth. You can see how I might have thought, given that's his one defining feature, that that was him. Anyway, hey, Edwin. I will take care. Greetings. I am Edwin Odesseron. You simians may refer to me merely as Sir, if you prefer a less syllable-intensive workout. Edwin! Don't you recognize me? It's Felix. 
Wait, I remember you, Edwin. As I recall, you should be dead. Death is often nothing more than a momentary inconvenience for one such as I. My ultimate mission is too important to suffer distraction from simpletons. The past hardly matters. The company you currently keep now limits your use. No matter, I shall make this transaction as quick and as bloodless as possible. Your memory is selective, Red Wizard. Why do you now work with Shadow Thieves, and what is your connection to our capture by Aranicus? Khalid is dead, and I will have an answer. If your whining husband is dead, Druid, it has nothing to do with me. And as for answers, you must go much higher than me to be satisfied. My association with the Shadow Thieves has been accomplished for reasons of my own, none of which have anything to do with you. Hear me. It seems my prowess as a mage has captured the eye of the cowled wizards. I am certain they are envious, though their actions are not fitting tribute. They have dispatched an agent to investigate my activities, something I don't appreciate. This insult must be punished by killing the cowled agent. Reik Gethras is his name. His house is a grey three-story behind a fence along a westward wall of the docks district. If he is home, his door will be open. When you find Reik Gethras, kill him. Question him beforehand if you like. Any insight into the cowled wizards is useful. A little torture would soften him. Murder, torture? We have no desire to commit such acts. Odd, given your lineage. I would have thought you capable of anything. Damned, I wish they would just do as I say. Ooh, lineage. What well, do you know of my heritage, Edwin? What are you privy to? By the shabby look of him, it was appearing of barnyard pro uh, proportions. I meant nothing, I assure you. I merely ask that you reconsider. Um, no dice, not a chance. Now you are just being foolish. You will have even less value to the guild if you refuse this simple request. Hmm, I pictured this with much more obedience. Um, get someone else to do your dirty work, coward. Two can keep a secret if one is dead. Prepare for the final judgment. Alright, take the quest or die. Got it. Well, not die, but like lose him as a companion. Very uh, well. Greetings. I am Edwin yes, Odessa. You simians may refer to me merely as Sir, if you prefer uh, a less syllable intensive right. workout. Don't worry, I'll still do it. I just want to register my disapproval. Good. Don't linger about then. Get going. Ugh, motivating these sloths is like pulling teeth. Are you not concerned about arousing the, hour, uh, the ire of the cowled wizards for such a deed, Felix? Let's hope the blame falls on the Shadow Thieves and not upon our own heads, eh? Yeah, well, what, what can we do if it does fall upon our heads? Not really a lot of options if we want to do your quest, mister. Uh, let's hand this back. Also move these around. Uh, you can now have your bow back. I look for. I will still keep the rest of the stuff I've confiscated. Uh, that, yes, that's the fake door. I, I remember now. I right, will and then we can this. leave out this way. Cool. I where does this door go this. then? Yeah, where does that go? Just out of curiosity, more than anything else. Oh, it that does go there. Easily. Oh, why did I think it didn't? I guess we just never tested it. So, who's, whose house are we going to? We are going to... Reik Gethras's house. Reik Gethras. Reik Gethras. Oh, over here. Okay. Well, I mean, that seems easy enough. Yeah, we'll just head down there. Right. I am preparing myself mentally for losing Nalia in our party. I mean, the positive side is Nalia is kind of limited in her character. By limited, I mean that Nalia, because she's taken four levels in Thief, is kind of like a little bit behind the curve, I would reckon. Although, I guess it doesn't matter because she's only 5,000 XP in Thief when she's got like this much out of Thief. She's actually the same level as everyone else. Maybe I'm misjudging multi-classing. Maybe multi-classing is actually just really good and not actually bad at all because... Th the way XP works in the game, she's only behind on the early levels, which we've skipped. 
You know what? That's probably fair. I'm probably misjudging multicasting. Atlassing. Have I already been here? Oh, hello everybody. Um, kill. Uh, kill. Kill. I am ready. Kill. I think. Backline. This. Uh, this one. Nice. Okay, you here. Backline. This one. Okay, you here. Backline. This one. Perfect. Actually, this one. Yes. Backline. This one. I will do what I must. To battle and okay. victory. Okay. And now we're done. Nice. Easy. It shall be. Very well. Right. Quick save. Grab this. Um, these are fine. I guess you can hold on to them for just now. Yeah, where are we? You? What do you need? I am. Get I it? can dance on the head of a pin as well. And get it. You know what? I'm just remembering. I think that's how. Um. Him. Uh, Oh no! Uh, never mind. I was thinking, was that how he died previously? Uh, like I drop um, your item on the how ground. Edwin died by him Carry giving us no a quest more. and us refusing? No, he died previously because he was um, exclusive with Dinah here. As in, you could either have Dinah here or you could have him. That was what happened, wasn't it? Yeah. So it's kind of the same, but like slightly different. It was the, uh, my if we take no him, then we lose Dine here and my we lose Mint, no which was unacceptable at the here. time. I think that was it. Something it's been a while. Wrong here. Something is wrong here. Yeah, I don't know if something no is wrong something here, but these guys will here. kill the stone golems no problem, kill so I don't see a reason to, like, it. switch out all your equipment. What's this? Oh, you've been slowed. Oh, Okay. I was wondering why you were stuttering a little bit there in terms of the uh, moving around. Nature's a little self-heal here while you're uh, sorting yourself out. Here we go, although it's going to be a slowed down heal, I guess. Cool. What would you have me do? Uh, don't see anything else here. It's gone. Cool. I will take Up the stairs. Declare Hello. yourself. Hold, how dare you intrude on my studies. Oh, pardon me then, I'll be on my way. Out, out then. Or out you go, or you shall suffer the wrath of my great magic. Kill him. You are warned. Now I, Rayek Gethras, shall deal with you as the ignorant peasant that you are. That's not good. Um, could you cast remove defenses, please? Curse it. Ah! A little help here. I will require healing if I am to be a curse it. Did that work? I don't think that worked. Spell failure. Oh no, I'm about to die. You just went invisible. It will oh. be done. Hit him. Nalia, um, magic missile. Critical hit averted, it said there. What's that? Oh, that's just saying you're there. Okay, that's fine. Where are one of these? Little acid arrow. Dorn, wanna hit him? Are we not allowed to hit him right now? He took three acid damage. Okay, so he can take damage right now. That's fine. Hey, he's taking damage. You want to cast your spell? All right, we go. That's fine. I had to drop your item on the ground. I can carry. Well, no we'll more. wait for everybody to uh, chill themselves out for a second here. Does it all run around like headless chicken? I'm sure we were told to tor uh, to torture him for information first, but like. He didn't really seem like he was talking, and our two options were, you're gonna die, or pardon me, I'm leaving, so, you know. That's fine. Just gonna wait for these spells to wear out. What I might do is save, and then reload, to see what happens. Yeah, let's, let's maybe do that. 
once these things were off. They're all still feared. You might be like, hey, could you not, like, remove fear? Yeah, I could remove fear. But there are two problems with that. The first is, I don't want to use the resources because there's no reason to. The second is, the person who probably has removed fear, I think is Jahira. Either that or it's a nomad. And either way, they're not really in a position to do anything. There we go. Right. <laughs> I wanted to wait till they were all done before I do a save. Right, now we can load the quick save before we speak to him. Wanna go kill that over there? Come on, Very let's kill well. something. And let's see what Declare he has yourself. to say. Here to end your life. I'll not suffer such insolence. Then he attacks us. Okay. That's fine. Murder, death, kill. Just Murder, needed death, to confirm. <laughs> Very well. Okay. Weird. Um, that's fine. Uh, do you have any space? Probably do if I chuck a couple of these back to Dorn. Actually, you know, how about a couple of these over to you to carry? Yeah, there we go. Then we'll chuck these over to you. Just to find out what those are, and then that can go there. Nice. Quarter staff plus two, and bracers of the vent seven, otherwise known as not as I good as our bracers. What's this? Scratch. Come on, let's kill something now. It shall be. <laughs> I had to drop your item on the ground. I can carry no more. Okay, that's fine. So I just needed a moment. Moment of composure. Sort myself out. Very well. There we go. Oh, you, you, there's a trap there, is there? Oh, I didn't know that. Thank you for letting me know. Really appreciate it. <laughs> All right, now we can chuck these over here for just now. That's fine. Right. Please disable the trap. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. And show me what's there. So you got this, which is a wand. Nice. I think I just picked it up and put it back in his own inventory. <laughs> right. Please disable the trap on Lead the foot table. and all that. Okay. What's that? Mislead. Oh. Okay, when this spell's cast, the wizard is affected by improved invisibility and teleported a few feet away from the original position. Oh, cool. That's kind of neat. I have too much in my pack as it is. You'll have to pick that up off the ground. Okay, that's fine. What would I look forward Any to? Any other loot in here? No. No, that's it. That's it. Okay. Well, with that, I think we're going to end the episode there. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. There we are. We're going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. Um, next, uh, we're going to hand in the quest to... Uh, what's it? Edwin next time. Maybe get him as a companion. Maybe say goodbye to Nalia for a while. I don't know if Nalia is coming back. She may come back. It really depends when we get other companions. I know there are other mages in the game. Like, Yan is a mage, so... Actually, I suppose Yan will probably take her spot, but, you know, there's a chance she comes back. And the reason there's a chance she comes back is because her, um, like, because her um, reputation, not reputation, because her alignment is good, which is quite useful to have when you're going to end up being a good character. But, you know, she might not. She does, however, have the exact same things that a Noman does. So if a Noman ever comes back, I, I guess she's just going to replace Nalia. So, like, who knows? Anyway, thank you for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.